TikTok streamers let's troubleshoot issues with live studio audio, including microphones and headsets. Let's actually start though by searching Windows for the word sound settings. And we'll click on that option at the top. And where it says output here, you wanna typically select your headset. This is sound such as video games that's being played. So I'm gonna choose my Cloud2 wireless. And of course you can control the system volume. That is the amount of sound that plays through your headset with the slider. And let's scroll down and do the same with our microphone. So for me, the wrong microphone selected. So I'll select my quadcast. And here in Windows with the slider, you can turn up or down your microphone volume. So I might sound louder right now. If I go back to 50, I probably sound a little quieter. Sorry if that was loud. If you're not sure, just set it to 100 and we'll use the microphone slider in Live Studio. So now we can head to Live Studio. And honestly, they keep changing the design, but you're looking for this audio mixer option. And currently it pops up with three main options, which is microphones, audio, and media. We're gonna ignore the media one. That's just the sound effects option through Live Studio. And we're gonna focus on adding the correct headset and microphone. So if you have more than one headset or microphone added, then let's simplify it and delete things. So in this example, I've accidentally added a second microphone. So let's delete that microphone and then we'll make sure we've added the correct microphone later. But to start with, just make sure there's one microphone added. So I'm gonna click settings on the second one, general settings, and I'm just gonna press delete audio. And now let's make sure we have the correct microphone added. So I'll click settings, general settings, and in the drop down list, I'll just select the correct mic. You can see it wants a noise suppression setting, and I recommend at least medium or high if the viewers are complaining. But of course, you'll also see we've got this bar that we can scroll up and down. So try it with 100 to start with. I'll show you how to test it in a minute. And of course, if it's too quiet, increase it. If it's too loud, you can lower it. You'll see we've got all of these other options and you can typically just leave them as the default. I do not recommend using your computer speakers, but if you are, then turn on the echo cancellation. So if you have the headset, then as I've done here, just leave them all unchecked and press save. And we're gonna repeat this process for our headset. So click into settings, general settings, and from the drop down list, select the correct headset. Again, select speakers if you don't have a headset. And as before, we've now got this volume scroller where we can scroll up and down and this is your computer audio that your viewers will be hearing. And we don't need these other options. So we'll just press save. Now, as I mentioned, we can test this. So what's the simplest way to test it? Well, I've scrolled down a little bit. You can see there's this record button. So you're just gonna record a few seconds of you speaking into the microphone. And if you wanna test the headset, play some audio like a video or literally just this video. And then you can hear back what it sounds like. So just press record. You can see it's counting down three, two, one. And then this is now a test video to test my audio. And I'll press end. And you can see it's been saved. You just click C in folder and play the video. And you can now hear what both your headset and microphone will sound like to your viewers. And you can drop any comments if you need help.